The chanting that we do with the Shirley Grammar teaches the children the parts of speech, and it really is an amazing way for them to learn those parts of speech. They have a great time doing it, and the sing-songy chant stays in their minds. It incorporates writing, it incorporates sentence structure and improving their sentences by changing different parts of speech, such as an adjective or an adverb or a verb or even the subject. The physical movement involved in the chanting and the jingles is wonderful for younger children. As you can imagine, they have ants in their pants anyway. So um, being able to get up and just move and jump around and sing at the same time is wonderful. And then they are able to settle down after that. And We'll be continuing the Shirley Jingles as they go along through the years here at Covenant. And I will tell you that I also teach an algebra class and the eighth graders that have had Shirley Grammar can still tell you that an adverb answers the questions how, when, where. So it really does stick in the brains when they've been able to sing it and move with it. This little mound floating around Named the person, place, or thing with a knick-knack Cutty-whack, please don't the truth Isn't language fun and cool?